This is TSC and Me, presented by Trinity. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Trinity. Welcome back to part three of TSC and Me. On the last video, we showed you what my seizures looks like. Today, we're gonna show you more videos about my seizures. My dad is going to narrate during the videos you're about to see. Morning. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. These videos may be very hard to watch. I know, because they were hard for my dad is a witness. Before you watch this video, don't forget to like. And don't forget to subscribe. Trinity, you're going to get a shot today. Mm. Are you ready? I want to get down. No, you can't get down. You're going to get a shot. Blue shot. You know what the flu shot is? What is it? What is, what is it? What's the flu shot? You're pretty. Say happy Halloween. Happy Halloween! Little kisses. From the videos prior, you are definitely able to understand that my daughter was pretty vocal at just the age of two. Here in this video, I started recording her after I heard her making some grimacing noises as she was taking a nap around 1 o'clock p.m. You see from her body, the confusion in her eye, trying to regain control, regain her conscious state of mind. She sits up, she's clicking with her mouth. You'll hear her mother in the video calling her name. You'll hear Trinity, Trinity try to respond, and it seems that? as if she cannot respond. It's very faint. Who's this? You'll hear Trinity keep saying What's her a name? word repeatedly. You'll hear me ask her mother if she woke her up, because it was my belief that any kind of stimuli could have aroused a seizure from occurring at this point in time. More. Can I have a kiss? No. Or more. More what? Did you have a bad dream? Did you wake her up? Here I have two videos. Both are displayed on the same day, only 34 minutes apart. The first video on the left, I started at 2.15 p.m. And the second video on the right, I started at 2.49 p.m. This shows you that Trinity had two seizures within the hour. She could have up to 10 seizures a day. You could observe her body. You could observe what she's doing. She's looking confused. She's trying to regain her, her surroundings. Understand. Hi. She's looking for something underneath can the you pillow wave? and doesn't know where it is. Can the you right talk? side of the video, you can see her mouth clicking and she's kind of touching at her toes. Um, you'll eventually hear me snapping, trying to see if she can be reoriented to her surroundings. It's really sad. It's it's really sad. Other times you'll see her kind of picking at something that's not there. It's it's just a matter of the brain. The brain is trying to do something and it, it can't keep up. It can't compete. In this okay. next video, I want you to pay close attention to Trinity's right hand. Trinity is just now waking up from a nap and she is showing a, a type of contraction. It's basically her seizure manifesting as a reaching, grasping movement after ha having some type of post-traumatic epilepsy. Um, she's basically, she turns over, her left arm kind of looks numb, right? Then she starts using that right arm to kind of scratch around her body. She has this kind of panicky look that she's trying to regain consciousness. She's confused, so you see me with the camera right there moving back left and right, left and right with the light on just to see if I can try to observe if she's actually able to see me or if she's with me or if she's not if she's lucid if she's not the, not even an hour later from the video you just saw trinity had another seizure fight you it, hear me telling her to fight it because i know deep down that she can it's so hard being a parent and watching your child go through something and you can't do anything about it so you see my body is right there close to her. I'm trying to make sure she can't move. I'm trying to make sure that I'm trying to keep my baby safe. And it's so hard because you can't do anything for them. I'm pretty sure God was on our side at the moment of this video. I mean, this had to have been one of the shortest seizures that I witnessed her having. And she was able to recover from it quickly. 
the typical signs that were associated grimacing breath holding contraction stiffening of her limbs you see that she was kicking her legs and that's awesome that's what you want to see you want to make sure that your child can use those limbs to kick you saw me ask her for a high five i want to make sure that she's actually able to respond with those limbs as appropriately because the moment that she can't yeah. I'll know that something's wrong. <laughs> On today's video, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what you saw in the last video. We showed you what TSC associated with Ashley's spots looks like. And I work on my temple. If you look closely, you can see I have Ashley's spots on my face and on my belly. Ding, ding, ding.